on how to play call if you need me, Five Ants Joy. We're in standard tuning, there's no capo. The main chords we're working with is a C, an A minor 7, and this B chord. So C, A minor 7, this B, and then we have an F chord, an A minor 7 all the way up here, and a G. So those are just translated chords. Word right now, we're just gonna walk through the progression and talk along as we go here. So um, a C chord, I'm assuming you're gonna have some prerequisite knowledge here. Your index is on your first fret of your B string, middle fingers on your second fret of your D, ring fingers on your third fret of your A string. And the difficult part about the song is the finger picking. So we're gonna pick with our thumb on our root note A string, and then our index is going to grab that G string, and our middle finger is going to grab the B string. And it's pretty quick strumming, but we'll go slow here. So A, G, B. You're going to do that four times on your um, C chord. Now you're going to drop your ring finger. So you're at your A minor 7. Same strumming, same strings. Do this twice. Now you're going to drop both those fingers, put your middle finger on your 2nd fret of your A string, and do that twice. And that's how the verse sounds. So the verse is actually pretty simple. So we have our C chord, A, G, B, A, G, B, this four times, that's three, here's four, drop your ring finger, do this twice, one, two, drop both fingers, Move your middle finger to the second fret of the A, do this twice. C, 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 A minor 7, B. That's how you play the verse. So the verse is pretty straightforward. Like I said, the tough part, the tough part is that finger picking. Um, <clears throat> so now this is a little more advanced, and this is the chorus. We'll go through it nice and slow here, though. So we start out on this F chord. Your index is on the third fret of your D string. That's your third string down. Your ring finger slid all the way over here on the 5th fret of the G, and your pinky is up here on the 5th fret of the high E string, that's your topmost string here. And our finger picking goes like this, but now we're going to pick our D with our thumb. Now our index is going to grab the G string, and your ring finger is going to pick on the high E. So, do this four times on this chord. Then we're going to slide up to this A minor 7 chord, where your index is on the 7th fret of the D. Your middle finger is now going to be on the 8th fret of the high E, and now your ring finger is on the 9th fret of the G. And we're going to do the same picking, so D, G, high E, but you only do it twice on that chord. Then we're going to slide back to our G. And the G is the same shape as this F, we just slide it up to this <clears throat> fifth fret here, so your index is on the fifth fret of the D, and these two fingers are on the seventh frets of the G and the high E. Okay, so let's walk through this nice and slow here, so four times on this F. A minor seven for two, back to your G for two. F, 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 A minor 7, G. And that's all there is to it. So, like I said, the tricky part really is that finger picking, so that's where you're going to have to practice a lot. Um, the chords aren't too difficult, um, but if you're a beginner, I understand, they might be a little tricky. Um, but that's going to be it for this tutorial. If you have questions, go ahead and comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.